How many have ever gone into a cave and the guide said, don't touch the formations, they take millions of years to form? They all got the same speech, right? You go over here to, uh, what's the one in Kentucky, uh, Mammoth Cave? Or go to Carlsbad Caverns and they say it took 250 million years. They did a study on these stalactites and one guy said, you know, the fastest they can grow is two and a half inches per thousand years. That's the maximum growth rate. I don't think so. Here are some 50-inch stalactites growing under the Lincoln Memorial. They did that in 40 years. There's a bat covered up with flowstone before it could even rot. There's two-inch stalactites growing off refrigeration shed in Pensacola, Florida. There's a guy in a building in Indiana built just 40 years ago, has huge cave formations in the basement of the building from water leaking through the limestone. There's a mine was shut down in Australia for 55 years. When they opened it back up to check it out, there were huge cave formations in 55 years. There's a pipe that was dripping water for seven years, made a 13-inch stalactite. I thought it was two and a half inches per thousand years. It's more like two inches per year. They broke off the stalagmite that was under it and gave it to me. It's in my museum. There's a parking garage built 1997 in Texas. It was making stalagmites on the students' cars parking under it. They had to put up a drip pan to catch the water. A guy in Wyoming had a hot mineral spring on his property in Thermopolis, Wyoming. So he stuck a pipe in the ground. The water came out the top of the pipe and bubbled out the side of the top of the pipe, you know. But it had a little fountain. They called it the TP fountain. Well, the guy died. They left the pipe sticking in the yard. As the pipe was there, it, it left behind mineral deposits as the water evaporated. How many have seen these mineral deposits? You get them on your sink up here? Okay. The guy died in the, about uh, 95 years after, he died, after the pipe was stuck in the ground. I went to see it. Here it is back in 1998. That would take some lime away to scrub that thing clean, don't you think? Yeah, a little bit. The guy down the street started his later. It's not quite as big, you know, but uh, 